pretty wild. It was actually pretty easy. I didn't take that much force at all, actually. Let's uh, release this and see what we got. I'm actually surprised that the bolts didn't pull out, but the leg mount destroyed. That's really fascinating. Interesting results. Look at how that metal just cracked. That's from this being hardened. Fascinating, extremely fascinating. Really cool. Looks like the fireball leg hasn't budged an inch. The point of these exercises is for me to really test and put this design through its paces. So what I wanna do is reset up the test again, but I'm gonna attach the leg over here to this table back over here and pull off of it. The goal here is to break the dragon wagon. I'm not trying to make this table look bad in any kind of way. I just wanna compare it to this table. So let's bolt this leg back to the outside. So let's do it again. All right, round two. Break, baby, break. Come on, dragon wagon, break a leg. Let's go. Dang, this is already snapping over there. Let's go. Come on, break. Break. Nope. Dang, we're just freaking reefing that leg over. We're just bending the tube. Let's just keep going. Come on, break. Ugh. <laughs> oh, yeah. okay, not gonna break. What are we holding at? <laughs> Ooh, 1,200 kilograms. That's a lot of load, what's that? 2,645 pounds are on that leg right now. You can definitely see that it's pulling. A little buckle in that flange, not bad though. Whew. This one does not look very good though. I say we just keep going. Break, leg, break, come on. Ugh. Come on, leg. Pop! Jeez! <laughs> uh, we're definitely buckling, check that out. Ooh, it's kind of scary. 1,384 kilograms, 3,051 pounds. Take a look at that. We are finally seeing some distortion here at 3,000 pounds of side load. That's pretty impressive. And then look at this one. Here's what we got. <laughs> That's kind of what I expected was gonna happen. I needed to pull up against something. Okay, so we have 3,000 pounds of tension on this. I'm gonna whack this right here. I'm gonna see what breaks. 